Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Drew, and I'm posting another video. So, um, second video in two days. Um, first off, I want to start out with this. I don't know if there are any, any beer drinkers out there, but this is Stone IPA. This is an IPA. It's my favorite beer. This is bottled in San Diego, California. It's probably not my favorite IPA, but um, it's pretty damn good. It's got 6.9% alcohol volume. So, if you're into IPAs, I might definitely recommend you give it a shot. Um, if you're just one of those guys that drink regular Budweiser all the time, this is probably not for you. But um, if you want to try something different, give it a shot. Anyway, what I want to get into today, guys, is uh, my favorite football player of all time, Damian Tomlinson. He's who I PC. It took me a while to start PCing him because um, by the time I got into collecting, a lot of his cards had already costed a lot of money. But um, he's the only player I really follow from the time they got to the NFL and just watch their rise into superstardom. I lived in San Diego when he was drafted. And, um, I didn't know much about him, don't know anything about college football. And when he was drafted, I remember, um, I think he had a scrimmage, and he had $50,000 earrings on, and he lost those in the first scrimmage. And my first impression of this guy is, what a tool. Who's wearing, you know, you just got paid, and you're in $50,000 um, earrings. But um, anyway, once I saw him play from game one, the the man is amazing. He's absolutely amazing. He's an absolute humble football player. I don't like showboats. I mean, that's all fun once in a while, watching somebody do something crazy. But he scores a touchdown, he flips it to the ref, and he's off the field. So, um, anyway, the guy is absolutely amazing. I think he's a first bout Hall of Famer. Um, upset that his career was cut short. And I'm upset that San Diego let him go. And for all the years he filled up that empty stadium... Um, they couldn't have done something better for him than that. Let him go to the New York Jets. So, in my mind, that's a tragedy. Um, I almost stopped being a Charger fan, but you still got Philip Rivers there. We finally filed, fired the general manager. So, um, I think that's enough said. You can go on with that conversation forever. Um, I just want to show you some of my Damien Tomlinson cards. I don't have a ton. These first few aren't very expensive. Um, these are manufactured patches, and um, I found them on eBay. And when you get them in the mail, they actually just look amazing. So, um, in person, I should say. This is out of 65 out of 75 from Upper Deck Premier Stitchings. And the year is 2007. So, beautiful card right there. This next one is not quite as, um, I don't know. It's not quite as nice, but I still like it. This is out of a uh, Sweet Spot Classic. 2003, and this card is not numbered. Still very nice. Here's my favorite one. This is out of a, this is 2003 Upper Deck Patch Collection. I love this card. This is my favorite one out of all three. If uh, you're a fan of somebody that's on one of these cards, um, I definitely recommend you to pick it up. Probably get it for $5, and once you see it in person, it's a gorgeous card, so definitely check it out. Um, now I'm going to go into um, some cards I got in the mail today. Let's we'll just start with this one. This one's from a Topps Tribute. It's the Emerald version, I believe, 6 out of 75. That's from 2007 Topps Tribute. I did this, uh, I almost completed the rainbow when I was collecting Nelson Cruz. These Top Tribute base cards and base parallel cards, they look absolutely amazing when you take them out of the plastic and you look at them in person, so, um, I definitely encourage anybody to um, pick some of them up. If you have any, definitely let me know. I'm always willing to trade or to purchase, so I'm just definitely, you know, keep me in mind. This next one here is from SPX of three of my favorite Chargers. This is out of 2007. You got Rivers, Gates, and Tomlinson. So, very nice card right there. And um, it's a very nice design from SPX, too. This is his rookie autograph out of stage. Not the best looking card, but um, one of his more popular cards. Very clean auto. Um, I had this one before, and I let it go, and then I picked it up for the same price that I let it go for. And it's got a cleaner auto, and it's a cleaner card. You can get this card anywhere in the $12 to $20 range if you're patient. So it's a must-have. Then I got this one. This is from... Um, Sweet Spot Signatures, it is 
22 out of 100, I believe. And that's the gold version out of 2006 Sweet Spot. Real clean auto on there. Love that card. This one's out of Prime Signatures. It's got the 21 uh, 10 out of 10 out of 49 and inscribed at 21. So like that card. This is my first triple threads auto. It's triple jersey auto. At about 2010, number 14 out of 18. So as you can see, um, he doesn't often do inscriptions. It's a real nice card. This, unfortunately, is a card that um, I do not like, but um, he's in a Jets uniform. That sucks. But this one actually has an inscription. Beautiful auto, all on the sticker, out of Playbook. 2012, 17 out of 21. So he did okay in the, he did okay with New York, but uh, hated that he had to be in that locker room and all that mayhem. And I just missed him. It was it was devastating to me that we lost him. Um, this is SPX. Actually, I guess he is inscribing a lot of them. I'm kind of new to his autographs. This has got number 21, not the cleanest card. I believe it's out of, I can't see too good, but it's out of uh, Super Scripts, so I can't get the year off of there right now. Still happy to have it. There's one all sandwiched up, unfortunately. Um, this is in the TCU, this is a TCU autograph, um, William Thompson, and he uh, inscribed it number five, Long Star Signature. Sorry about that, Claire. This is a graded card. I didn't pick it up because it was graded. I just picked it up because I got it pretty cheap. It's at an upper deck. Authentics, uh, Authentics American. Authentics level one. It's a eight. They didn't grade the auto on here, so it's just a eight near mint card. So um, Take right the auto, I don't think you get the highest grade because part of it's under the card, so. But whatever. Still happy to have it. Okay, here's another one. Another rookie auto. This is out of 1400 out of Sage. Described with the number five. Okay, this is SP Authentic on card auto. Having a real trouble picking up the years on here. But here's the guard. So, uh, real nice. Here's an on card one out of Pacific 2001. So, this is a rookie auto. Uh, 1059 out of 1500. Inscribed number five. Kind of hard to see with the blue thin sharpie. But when you look at it in person, you can definitely see it. This card's in wonderful condition. Here's another one that's a little beat up. The edges is kind of, eh. Uh, it's Ultimate Sunday Star Signature. It's out of 2007 Ultimate. 48 out of 50. So there you go. Um... Okay, here's just one that I got in today. It's another triple triple jersey out of Artifacts. Rivers, Tomlinson, and Gates. 9 out of 75. Love this card. It's got a little shine to it. Real nice. The last card I'm going to show you is one of my favorite. Um, you get a case for it. It's 47 out of 49. Out of Playbook. Jim Brown, Terrell Davis, Marshall Falk, and LaDamian Tomlinson. So, I don't know if I got them all in there. Yep. It'd be nice if it was patches, but um, this is an awesome card. I love it. Got it for a steal, and I will be holding on to this. So, um, that's all I got, guys. Thanks for watching. You guys have a good night. Oops. Breaking shit.